It is Father's Day weekend, and one dad in New York is especially grateful. He'll be celebrating with his young son, who is here thanks to his dad and a life-saving operation. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez has more. <laughs> Jacob Ortiz and his dad are now regulars on the playground, but just six months ago, the two-year-old was deathly ill. We were very scared. It was a very dark time in our lives. Jacob was diagnosed with biliary atresia, a rare liver malformation. The bile ducts don't form properly. There's no way for bile to get out of the liver, and the liver becomes diseased and ultimately fails. After several unsuccessful treatments, doctors said Jacob urgently needed a new liver. But an organ his size rarely becomes available. So Jacob's dad gave his son a piece of his own liver. When you see your child in need, you want to do um, what you can to help out as much as possible. Dr. Sander Florman is the director of the Transplant Institute at Mount Sinai Hospital in New York. We need an artery, a vein, we need a bile duct, but we can split the liver in a way that we can actually use part of the liver to transplant the child. During a successful six-hour transplant surgery in February, doctors removed about 25% of Jose's liver and gave it to Jacob. That piece of liver will actually grow along with Jacob for the rest of his life. I'm just grateful, honestly, that, that, uh, that I was able to do this. I wish I could give him a parade. <laughs> he deserves everything. <laughs> Even though father and son were a close match, Jacob must still take anti-rejection medication. But doctors say his liver problem is cured, and he's now a normal, healthy little boy. Truly a happy Father's Day. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.